this is America's most famous admiral. You know, it, it's it's so it's such an important issue for our youth and adults. As you said, some of these laws are actually extending in, into adulthood. You know, we often say that gender affirming care is health care. Gender affirming care is mental health care. And gender affirming care is literally suicide prevention care. Would that be your view as well? I 100 percent agree. It's so it's genuinely I want to actually genuinely give my heartfelt condolences to any young person who falls for this crap because you're going to be so miserable for the rest of your life. If you chop off your genitals, and take a whole bunch of chemicals as a teenager, you are going to be miserable for the rest of your life. Yes. You're never going to be the person you want to be. You're never going to be accepted as that person. You're never going to feel happy inside. If you fall for this, I genuinely feel sorry. For you. That's the first thing I'm going to say. The second thing I'm going to say, I find it very interesting that the only surgery we call affirming is gender surgery. Imagine a girl woke up and said, I was born in the wrong body because my tits are small. I'm a big titted woman. But I was born in the wrong body. I need gender, I need a tit affirming care. I need to affirm my true body shape. Because otherwise I have a mental health problem. No, it's, 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 it's plastic. It looks good, perhaps, whatever. But we would never say she was born in the wrong body and we had to affirm her genuine body experience. Her triple D's. Yeah, yeah. Her triple D's had to be affirmed. It's garbage. You're, you're not affirming anything. And also, I think it's kind of interesting. They say that trans people commit suicide at a higher rate. That's sad. Nobody should kill themselves. I, I would hate for anybody to kill themselves. They say that's because they're picked on for being trans. I don't know why anyone's ever had the argument that perhaps they have a mental instability before this trans stuff, and that's why they're more prone to, to suicide in the first place. Seems like an obvious explanation. Seems like an obvious explanation. I don't think it's normal for anybody to want to mutilate themselves. I, I think if someone were to come to me and say, I really want to cut my hand off, I would think they had a mental illness. Why? Don't like it. You, mean you don't like it. I don't like my hand. I don't want it. I would think that's very concerning. So I really, truly feel sorry for any young people who fall for this. I don't blame them. I think it's a massive psyop. And I think if you fall for it, you're going to be miserable forever. And I, one more point I'll make on this whole thing I found very interesting. I'm a professional fighter, so I spent a lot of time in Thailand when I was fighting. Kickboxing's big over there. And I've always thought, no one's ever mentioned that Thailand has a bunch of ladyboys, right? But if you say to a ladyboy, are you a man or a woman? Because I'm a ladyboy. What's that? I'm a man, but I'm a ladyboy. They don't see themselves as women in the real sense of I am female. Right. They don't want to compete against women in sports. They don't want to pretend they can have kids. They don't talk about having periods. They're like, oh, I'm a lady boy. It's like kind of like an in-between, it's got yes. its own thing. India has the same. Yeah, it's fine. Nobody over there is genuinely arguing that they are actually female. Only in America are we do. And that's what's the craziest thing of all. Even if you truly, truly believe you need to change gender and you truly believe it's the right path for you and you believe you're not being psyoped and you believe you're going to be happy and you believe you need to mutilate yourself, that's all fine. But then to come along with the hubris and arrogance to tell me that I have to pretend you're something you're not. Yeah, biologically. That's right. That's absolutely not really arrogant. 